hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so new winter update is just around the corner today is november 10th and that means that the halloween update is gone in five days but that is okay because that means the christmas update is coming in five days or maybe a little bit later anyways what i'm trying to say is that you need diamonds for this every single update you're gonna need diamonds regardless because there's always sets that come out for halloween whimsy witch came out goth cutie came out and all of these require diamonds and you're like i want to get everything but i don't have enough diamonds to get everything and definitely not enough time to farm all of those diamonds i'm here to help because i have the perfect ways of farming to make you gain diamonds so fast as you can see i have 791,000 diamonds and i've gotten this in like a span of a month or less i haven't really been spending them just because i haven't had anything to spend them on but I want to show you guys how to farm diamonds so you guys can just have lots of diamonds in your inventory. My first farming method is profit trading. So if you see on my channel, I have a couple profit trading videos and that's kind of how I blew up a little bit. And I want to show you how easy profit trading is, how to profit trade, and why you should choose profit trading. Okay, so what really is profit trading? Well, profit trading is, is a form of farming method, also a general method in everywhere you go, where you buy something for less, or you buy something for a little bit of its price, and you sell it for more, or you sell it for its price. So an example of this would be Tradery. Tradery is a community site that bases community values on what they think on what it should be. So these are people who are willing to sell and buy items for the community price. So before you say anything, this is not scamming. So I use Tradery to sell my items and list them. And what I do is I go to the trading hub and I buy an item for less and then I sell it on Tradery for, for its community value price. All I'm doing is I'm buying for less and I'm selling more. Okay, so I'm going to kind of analyze a trade with you here so you guys can kind of see where i'm coming from in more in depth so this video is on my channel it's how to become a pro profit trader in 2023 and i kind of explain this stuff here but i kind of miss some stuff and i want you to like kind of i want to just analyze this trade with you so you you know what i'm talking about i'm in trading hub i usually ask like hey i'm looking for a shop can it does anybody have shop and if they do and if so can they trade me so that's kind of what this trade is about so she's already showing me her shop and i kind of look for stuff and i there's certain stuff that don't go good so i saw that december dream skirt just because they do so good they like okay, how to explain it the more they're worth the higher your chances are of selling it and the higher chances are of buying it so that's why i bought december dream skirt and goddess of triumph earrings so i bought i think i got them for like half price and then i sold them on tradery for like obviously half more price so i got double what i was giving so i got i paid forty five thousand for this when forty thousand is worth the skirt and thirty thousand or thirty five thousand is worth the earrings so that that there is a lot of just diamonds profit traded i'm going to show you how tradery works so you kind of you're not like confused so you can see that these are like the top games that are like big on trading and Zebra High is a second. So that's what I'm going to pick. And all of these like items, that's what it says it's hot, but it's not really. So um, let's say that I was going to offer for Steampunk Corset. So I'm going to search up Steampunk Corset because that's what we're looking for. It's worth 164. That's the community price. This is tradery price. So we're going with this one because this is what people would mostly buy it for so say i'm trading somebody i'm um, obviously i'm gonna buy it for let's say 130,000. that is 34,000 profit trade and that's really quick and if you're not sure what to offer if you don't want to offer diamonds you want to recent trades and all of these are like this person traded goddess of triumph heels for this 160 158 162 all that stuff okay so my next farming method is leveling up so i really like leveling up um especially in campus 3 just because it does give me so much xp and um i have multipliers 
so it really is like super helpful for me i think that if you don't have multipliers i don't think that this method will work for you even if you have times two multipliers i mean it just takes longer i think that if you want to get game passes you should definitely get the multipliers both of them just because they do give you so much and this method benefits me in two ways i get diamonds and i get levels and it's with the new level up rewards um i kind of like get, having all of the level up rewards and doing this method gives me diamonds while doing this so i really like it okay so i'm gonna show you kind of like examples of pretty high xp quests and this is brush your teeth this is 83 xp and the ones with higher xp do take more time so but it's worth it just because it's just you're not really doing stuff while you're gr grinding for the xp so always try to do the high xp ones because they give you so much xp so fast T brushing teeth does take a while but this is kind of what i mean about just like having like doing your quests and like trick-or-treating in dorms is super easy super fast it gives you 25 xp so this is kind of how i get my diamonds when i don't really want to go in the training hub that's kind of what i do i just go in the campus and grind for levels and it does benefit me because I get all of these um, star achievements. So, see, I've unlocked quite a bunch because I just, I really enjoy um, farming for levels. So, yeah. Okay, everyone, that is all for today's video. I really hope that my tips kind of helped you out and you're ready for the winter update that is soon to come. I'm actually pretty excited for it. Um, that's really all for today's video. I'll see you all in my next week's video. Oh. What's this person doing? Hi. Anyways, um, yeah, I let me know if any of these tips helped. I really hope because these are the tips I use all the time when I'm farming for diamonds. So yeah, let me know. Okay, see you all in my next one. Bye everyone.